Yes, Peter, good afternoon to all the students. Very less participants are there today, maybe due to the busyness in kite flying, still the students are coming. So let's uh, continue. You're going to finish this chapter, the proposal. Uh, Lomov comes to meet Shubukov. We have read so far that Lomov, Shubukov, and Natalia, you already know all the characters, fine. So Lomov, the prospective, because you can say the, he is like wants to marry Natalia and he has come to meet Shubukov, the father of the girl and one of his neighbors as well. He tells about his intention of getting married to Natalia and then Natalia enters and both fall into the arguments about oxen meadows, that controversial land both of the families claim to be there on. Fine, after the uh, very rude conversation, Lomov leaves the class, uh, sorry, leaves the room and then Lomov after when Lomov leaves then Shubukov tells Natalia about the proposal he made that day that that's why he had entered over there that he want to get married to Natalia when Natalia wants to know this she is also very materialistic and she knows that even Lomov is rich enough then she says that you should call him immediately right now she starts crying and she starts that drama and uh, father has to call the boy back and when Lomov again enters the scene and Lomov was called again. Again, the, you know, Natalia tries to change the conversation by saying, okay, meadows are yours only. Then let's talk about something else. She starts, uh, he starts telling about his dog that he has gone lame and he's not well. And then the conversation started and finally their arguments again about whose dog is best starts. Clear? So conversation kya start ho jate? Now students are joining, maybe between uh, they got the message I sent to them. So again, arguments about uh, amongst all three of the people started and it was about dogs this time. Okay, so they were talking about dogs that whose dog is better than uh, the other one. Fine. So Natalia says my dog is better, but he's just, you know, showing that my dog is the most costly one and uh, in taking care of the dog, it is quite a huge amount he has paid, how many rubbles he paid. So they both are actually showing their uh, worth that our dog is better or yours is not. So in that way, conversation goes on and uh, let's take it further. So we were on this page, beta. We are going to complete it today. Conversation was going on when uh, Lomo and Natalia were uh, you can say in a very rude way, they were talking to each other about whose dog is best. Lomo said, excuse me, I cannot continue this discussion. My heart is palpitating. So I told you already that he was suffering with palpitations in which your heart skips a beat and it starts beating faster also. It, I have noticed that those hunters argue most who do least. You know, she does not stop the conversation. She takes it further. Madam, please be silent. My heart is going to pieces. Shout, shut up. I shan't shut up, means I shall not shut up until you acknowledge that Squeezer is a hundred times better than your guess. Guess is the name of dog of Lomo and Squeezer is the dog of Natalia. So Natalia says that my dog is better. Firstly, you have to speak that. Only then I will keep your mouth shut. A hundred times worse, be hanged to your Squeezer. His head, eyes, shoulder. So better a hundred times worse. There is no need to hang your silly guess. He's half head already. Uh, Lobo starts crying. Shut up, my heart is bursting. See, he had that problem of palpitations and even then he's not uh, stopping in that arguments. I shall not shut up. Enter Shubukov. Shubukov again enters. What's the matter now? Papa, tell us truly, which is the better dog? Our squeezer or his guest? Stephen Stepanovich, I implore you to tell me just one thing. Is your squeezer overshot or not? Yes or no? And suppose he is. What does it matter? He's the best dog in the district for all that and so on. Shubukov also is of the same opinion as his daughter Natalia. He says that our dog is best, obviously. But is not my guest better really now? Don't excite yourself, my precious one. Allow me. Your guest certainly has his good points. He's pure bred, firm on his feet, has well sprung ribs and all that. But my dear man, if you want to know the truth, the dog has two defects. He's old and he's short in the muzzle. 
so he started with pointing the uh, though he tells though shubhukov narrates the best features of lobov's dog but even that he is not you know aise logon pe kya hota superiority complex this is the problem with rich people the both the merchants all three of them they are you know obsessed with superiority complex ki mai better hu ya wo better hai mera dog better hai ki uska dog so in that way they are like uh, you know uh, insulting one another excuse me my heart let's take the facts now you see again us ne usko my heart my darling keh ke bulana shuru kar diya because he is watching that he is observing that the future prospect grew with him for his daughter let's take the facts you will remember that on the marusinki hunt my guests ran neck and neck with the count's dog while your squeezer was left a whole rest behind so when they were doing hunting one day all the dogs were into hunting your dog was not able to run because he is old he got left behind because the count's whipper in hit him with his whip kitna usko usne mara tha whip ke sath wo chabuk ke sath he was a badly wounded that's why he could not run why you are blaming him for this thing and with all good reason the go- dogs are running after a fox when squeezer goes and starts worrying the sheep so he says that my dog is not at all interested at that time so that's why he was not running it's not true my dear fellow i'm very liable to lose my temper and so such because of that let's stop arguing you started because everybody is always jealous of everybody else's dogs yes we are all like that you do sir are not blameless you know sooner begin with this that and the other and all that i remember everything so shubhukov kehta hai ki don't check my patience i can argue with you at anything with at any length so please everybody is jealous of others dogs so please stop this conversation lomov kehta hai yes i remember too i remember too what do you remember my heart my foot has gone to sleep i can't side by side he is having his palpitations as well my heart what sort of a hunter you are you ought to go and lie on the kitchen over and catch black beetles not go after foxes my heart talle usko again insult kar rahi hai that hunting pe jaate ho you go for the hunt of the bees only beetles only and uh, uh, you are uh, supposed to go for hunting of fox my heart fine this is not called hunting when you catch beetles hunting usko bolte when you go to catch fox my heart what sort of hunter are you uh, see yes really what sort of hunter are you anyway shubhukov says you ought to sit at home with your palpitations and not go tracking animals kehta hai tere ko to palpitations se free nahi hai that you keep on having your problems and how can you go to track animals and go for hunt you could you could go hunting but you only go to argue with people and interfere with their dogs and, and so on let's change the subject in case i lose my temper you are not a hunter at all anyway आर्ग्यूमेंट्स कर भी रहा है शुभुकोव एंड साथ में ये भी कह रहा है कि इन केस आई लूज माय टेम्पर यू आर नॉट अ हंटर एट एन ऑल फाइन इन स्पाइट ऑफ डूइंग आर्ग्यूमेंट्स ही स्टिल से द सेम थिंग एंड आर यू अ हंटर यू ओनली गो हंटिंग टू गेट इन विद द काउंट एंड टू इंट्रीग ओ माय हार्ट यू आर एन इंट्रीगर लोमो सेड यू आर अ हंटर यू गो और हंटिंग टू गेट इन विद द काउंट एंड टू इंट्रीग इंट्रीग मींस पजल Oh my heart, you are an intriguer. Lobo says that you confuse people and you interfere into the things of others. You are like that. I am an intriguer. Shut up, intriguer boy, pup, old rat. So they start abusing each other. Shut up, or I'll shoot you like a partridge. You fool! Everybody knows that. Oh my heart, your late wife used to beat you. My feet, temples, sparks. I fall. I fall. so saath mein hi lobo is having the highest level of palpitations is about to fall and start arguing arguing bhi chhod raha hai wo and you are under the slipper of your housekeeper shubhukov says kehta you are under the slipper of your housekeeper there 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 my heart burst my shoulders come off here is my shoulder i die a doctor lobo falls into an armchair <coughs> out of that excitedness out of that conversation a lot of arguments he fell into the dark chair he fell sick boy milk soap fool i'm sick sick what sort of a hunter are you you can't even sit on a horse see wo gir gaya udhar chair pe that's why it is a farce na humor kaise add kiya hua hai wo gir raha hai aur upar se na talle is again taunting what sort of a hunter are you you can't even sit on a horse 
Papa, what's the matter with him? Papa, look, Papa screams. I will whistle, which he's dead. वो अपने फादर को कहती कि ये तो I guess it's he's dead only. Shubhukov, I am sick. I can't breathe air. Shubhukov कहता मैं तो बस you know I'm tired of this thing. मेरे को तो सांस नहीं आ रहा ये सब देखे क्या करी जा रही है? Why is it going to be answered? He's dead. Pulls Lobo's sleeve. I will whistle, which I will whistle, which what have you done to me? He's dead. A doctor, a doctor. Natalia also starts shouting after that. Oh, what is it? What's the matter? He starts having that, you know, problem of palpitations. What's the matter? He's dead, dead. Natalia says, "Ye to bas, he's gone." Wo rona shuru kar deti Natalia that he's dead. Who's dead? Looks at Lobo. So he is my word. Water. A doctor. Life is a tumbler to Lobo's mouth. Drink this. No, he doesn't drink. It means he's dead. And all that, I'm the most unhappy of men. Why don't I put a bullet into my brain? Why have not I cut my throat yet? What am I waiting for? Give me a knife. Give me a pistol. He seems to be coming round. Drink some water. That's right. While trying to make uh, Lobo drink water, Lobo is like he has fallen on the armchair. He's not responding. शुभकोव कह रहा कि मैंने अपने आप को ऐसे क्यों नहीं कर दिया मार क्यों नहीं दिया एंड वेटिंग व्हाट आई वाज वेटिंग फॉर एंड ऑल एंड आई सी स्टार्स मिस्ड वेयर एम आई एंड देन लोगो गॉट इनटू कॉन्शियसनेस वो बिल्कुल बेहोश हो गया था पहले सो व्हाई इज फीलिंग बैड शुभकोव इज फीलिंग बैड कि ओ माय गॉड व्हाट हैज बीन डन आई सी स्टार्स मिस्ड वेयर एम आई हरी अप एंड गेट मैरिड एंड वेल टू द डेविल विद यू शी इज विलिंग बिफोर ही fell unconscious they were fighting like anything <coughs> this is the ridiculous uh, society in even the darkest of times in ha can say difficult of times we think about our own meanness what we want he wanted to get her daughter married with that man because he was rich he is you know about to fade wo fade bhi ho gaya tha and again when he came back into consciousness What Shubhukov says, hurry up and get married. Well, to the devil with you. She is willing. Usne yes, bol diye. He puts Lobov's hand into his daughter's hand. She is willing and all that. I give you my blessing and so on. Only leave me in peace. कहता मुझे बस शांति चाहिए. तो इसको ले जा. You get married to this girl. What? To who? <coughs> uh, Lobov says. Kis ki baat kar rahe ho? She is willing. Well, kiss and be damned to you. He's alive. Yes, yes, I'm willing. वो भी साथ में ready हो जाती है. See, they were fighting like dogs. And now, when he gets consciousness, उनको लगता है कि this is the time you should, you know, go for the proposal. Kiss each other. A hey, kiss whom? They kiss. Very nice too. Excuse me. What's it all about? Now I understand. My heart starts. I'm happy. The Talia step one. My foot has gone to sleep. See. बीच में पैल्पिटेशन चल रही है बीच में दैट फाइटिंग वाज गोइंग ऑन एंड नाउ इन दैट ऑल दोस क्योर्स ही हैज गिवन हिज डॉटर्स हैंड इन लोबोव्स हैंड ही सेज आई एम हैप्पी द तलिया सेज आई एम हैप्पी टू व्हाट अ वेट ऑफ माय शोल्डर्स अ शुभकोव कहता है कि अब तो मेरा भार उतरा सारा बट स्टिल यू विल एडमिट नाउ दैट गेस इज वर्स देन स्क्वीज द तलिया सेज कहता बेटर फिर वो कहती वर्स Well, that's a way to start your family bliss. Have some champagne. He said, "Okay, this is the way we start our family's bliss. So let's have champagne. He's better." The Talia, Abhi, bhi, fir bhi, wo yehi lad rahe hai ki my dog is better, your dog is worse. My dog is better, your dog is trying to shout her down. Shubhogov, ko your uh, topic change kar rahe hai. Champagne, 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 and curtain falls. And chapter ends there. what do we learn from this chapter that how rich and affluent people of the society they want rich and affluent alliances even though they do not have you know they do not like the opposite party that they do not like the person who is getting married whether the person is having any physical ailment or mental disturbance that does not matter to them what matters to them is <coughs> getting equally rich family to get married uh, you can say into equal family they are rich and they should be rich so that was the main purpose of shubhukov to get his daughter married with lobo 
that was the purpose of lobos as, as well though he did not like the girl natalia that was even that he was ready to get married because she was also rich and natalia also though she does not agree with lobo not even an inch of it both of them disagree with everything ki kisi cheez mein agreement nahi hai but even that they are agree for the proposal so do you think the proposal made in this chapter is correct and apt do you think this is the right way to propose someone by seeing the wealth of the person no this is not okay so the proposal which is made in this chapter it is actually and uh you can say a lesson to the society actually we people are doing so we are into a lot of ostentatious behavior you know show off karna ostentatiousness is when we show off so uh, these days marriages they few of the entry of the groom from the helicopter and girls are coming into that any other way and entries be very you can say filmy type of and a lot of money is wasted when we see celebrity weddings and common masses those who are rich enough they are also following the same and proposals even for the proposals people choose destinations to propose so this is just sheer wastage of time will that marriage survive the question is that which is on the grounds of such things do you think such marriages will survive in future what a marriage requires is what a bond requires is mutual understanding mutual respect to each other and to the family members of the person as well not only the groom and bride but the groom's family as well as bride's family that is the true proposal when you respect each other and each uh, each other's feelings as well as the family members fine that is the true proposal your mental match your educational qualification fine that matters the most not money but people these days they you know measure your economic condition though you have 10 number of negative things you have ailments you do not look nice you do not speak you speak rudely but you are rich everything is covered fine so this chapter was written many years ago but it is still applicable fine so the proposal is actually a farce in a light comedy way you know comedy humorous way they have given a very serious lesson you know unke arguments kya aa rahe hain oxen meadows whose dog is better than her, her wine his or her so that argument is going on in spite of all they are getting married at the end and champagne is being shouted by the father of the daughter so that makes it a light comedy okay now let me share the screen once again let's start doing the question answer jitne ho jayenge beta we have a time enough 10 minutes are left who will give me the answer or very first question um, now they see when i come to the question you people start leaving you know the meet ki ma'am ne bhi questions puchne don't hesitate please what does shubhukov at first suspect that lobov has come for usko pehle kya laga tha is he sincere when he later and i have always loved you my angel as if you were my own son find reasons for your answers from the play do you think uh that he is uh, you can say <coughs> bhadu please answer this question for me if you are there ज्वाइन करा हुआ क्लास को तो प्लीज आंसर क्या लगा था उसको वाई लोमो हैज एंटर देयर मानू प्रताप आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू मार्क देम प्रेजेंट हु विल नॉट आंसर यस मैम यस प्लीज आंसर द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन बेटा मैम व्हेन लोमो व्हेन लोमो एंटर्ड द ड्राइंग रूम ऑफ लिविंग रूम ऑफ शुभकोव व्हाट डिड ही थिंक ऑफ हिम उसको क्या लगा था दैट व्हाई ही हैज कम देयर व्हाट वाज द रीजन मैम बोल लो मो मनी वॉर करने आया था यस ही सस्पेक्ट्स दैट लोबो हैज कम टू आस्क फॉर मनी ओके इज ही सिंसियर व्हेन ही सेज नो ही इज नॉट सिंसियर व्हेन ही लेटर जब उसको बाद में पता लगता है कि ओके ही हैज कम टू प्रपोज माय डॉटर देन ही सेज आई हैव ऑलवेज लव्ड यू माय एंजल एज इफ यू वर माय ओन सन ही इज नॉट ये झूठ है ही इज नॉट सिंसियर व्हेन ही सेज दिस बिकॉज़ 
in in on real basis shubhukov is very rude fine he is very selfish within he wanted to miss money only and property only so that his daughter can get married to the rich affluent man of the society that's why he changes his statement okay second question would you uh, shubhukov says of natalia as if she want consent she is in love god she is like a love sick cat would you agree find reasons for your answer actually in this uh, we should agree with shubhukov's uh, statement because when the talia comes to know that lobo had come with a marriage proposal she becomes desperate for him she starts wailing and crying and ask her father to bring him back fine so she is like a love sick cat here means she has nothing to do with the, uh, you can say that she was interested in getting married to lobov and shubhukov was aware of this thing so yes we agree with shubhukov's statement because natalia's reaction on finding about the proposal was uh, yes only clear find all the words and expressions in the play that the characters used to speak about each other and the accusations and insults they hurl at each other for example lobov in the end calls shubhukov an intriguer but earlier shubhukov has himself called lobov a malicious double faced intriguer again lobov begins by describing the talia fine as an excellent housekeeper and not bad looking so sabne kisi ke aapas mein they have just commented about the ones and all personalities fine kabhi usko keh raha tha excellent housekeeper hai not bad looking hai well educated hai then uske father ko keh raha tha that then he was like a intriguer father usko keh raha tha malicious so there are very dialogues beta you just need to shubhukov ne bola tha usko old rat intriguer grabber all the words you have to underline in the play lobov ne usko bola tha you are a good friend you are a good neighbor and then usko bola tha malicious double faced rascal blind head turnip ghost villain scarecrow monster stuffed sausage fine milk sob bahut sare words bole the natalia ko kya kya bola gaya hai a love sick cat excellent housekeeper not bad looking so these are the words which are associated with these three characters okay so such sort of questions you should just know at least but you will get the question which evoke your thoughts five adjectives or adjectival expressions of your own to describe each character in which beta you just need to find the same thing what they have used for them why they have used many words clear jo bhi unhone ek dusre ko bola hai all the adjectives you can write here this is again imaginary question beta you can omit such questions but mainly uh what sort of questions let me tell you they have not given proper exactly what i'm looking forward to reported speech and all as adults one important thing to learn is how to manage temper how to manage anger three ill effects of anger fine and away are there any benefits this is the question fine based on this chapter in this you can tell about how you know uh, anger uh, how the people who gets angry so quickly there are very in ill effects firstly they stop thinking at that time secondly they start using rough language or rude language and thirdly uh, it affects their own health as well as the mental health of the other person or it can affect our physical health as well as in this chapter he was having palpitations while argumenting with others right while arguing with others so that is the ill effects of anger how we can manage the anger by not putting ourselves into the arguments by going away from that scene for a while by counting 1 to 10 or 1 to 20 in our heart of hearts or drink water at the time we by not reacting to the situation so these are the ways how we can 
save this fine so they have just given that uh, exactly questions are near there so the this can be this play can also be considered romantic comedy romance is there plus comedy is there fine i will be beta giving you additional questions of this chapter actually they have not uh, uh, exactly given a list of questions based on this so please uh, note down some additional questions note down beta of the proposal because they have not given a uh, write down justify the title the proposal please note down i'm just giving you the list because they have not given sufficient sufficient questions to us to so make a list of it justify the title the proposal then character sketch of lomo character sketch of uh, shubukov and character sketch of natalia fine this you we have to do i'm just giving you the list i'm not discussing right now because bell is about to go within a minute or two so you just take a list of the questions we will discuss definitely on monday uh, uh, or we have to start new chapter as well because bahut syllabus hai bhi aapka so character sketch of uh, all the three characters justify the title uh fine discuss very important jo sample paper mein aaya hua hai cbse ke discuss the proposal as fars f a r c e all these are long questions beta abhi maine short discuss nahi kare hain mcq mein discuss nahi kare hain discuss the proposal as fars f a r c e fine title justification all the correct sketches and discuss this chapter as a fars that's enough for today okay rest of the questions short questions or quiz based on this chapter we will do we will uh, we will be doing later on